Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to generate your privacy policies and host them for free on Voltec.ml. So what you're going to want to do, go over to Voltec.ml. And as you can see here, not only do they publish your apps and games for free, if you want to check that out, you can see my other video. But if you look over here, generate and host your own privacy policy for free. Generate and deploy a privacy policy for your app in seconds. So you're going to want to click on start. Once you're here, you just need to fill out this form with some very basic information like your app name, email. So we're going to do that. I'm going to give you an example of what you're going to want to do. So for example, coloring, that's the name of my app. And the email Here, you're going to want to say if it's free, open source, freemium, ad supported, or commercial. So my app is free. Here's the developer slash company name. So this app is developed by vault -Tec. And here's some personal identifiable information. So this is the type of things that your app collects that you want to warn the user about, such as maybe audio or photos or accounts. I'm sure there's a list somewhere of all the things that your app can collect. So just see if it applies to yours and write it in here. So you want it to be comma separated. Uh, for example, audio has to be separated by a comma and a space from photos. So after you've done that, I'm just going to put accounts. After you've done that, make sure it's all filled in. Um, you're going to want to click generate and deploy. Once you're here, it says Voltec Privacy Policy successfully generated and is being hosted. Uh, link to coloring privacy policy. Remember the URL because you will not be able to submit another form with the same app name. So here's the link to your privacy policy, and this is the URL you have. Voltec publishes your apps and games for free. That's just a little ad right there. So you're going to want to click this, and it takes you to your privacy policy. So this is already being hosted. If you copy this URL right here, uh, it'll always take you to the same privacy policy. So this is the link you're going to want to put when they ask you for your privacy policy URL. And apart from that, make sure um, that you remember this URL because if you forget it, um, you're not going to be able to put the same app name twice.